Hey guys, what's going on? Comedy Episode Prime here. Today we're going to be adding those new figures to the Marvel Legends display and uh, just making it look better. But we have two things to do before we get on with our video. And the first thing we have to do is give a shout out to Trap Town's second channel. His logo looks like that. I'm not sure if he wanted his second channel uh, shouted out or his main channel, which is I'm um, pretty sure just Trap Town. But he makes awesome videos, so shout out to you, man. And uh, the second thing we have to do, I wanted to show off the pins I added to my uh, my sweatshirt. So you guys probably recognize this hoodie. I was wearing it uh, yesterday. So we have Yolplo 2 from It. Welcome to the Losers Club. Uh, I got like an It pack. I'm not sure if I showed that. I got Marvel pack, Marvel team up, make mine Marvel. Uh, this was also in the It one, it's Pennywise. We have the Marvel team. We have one that says Nuff Said which is Stan Lee's uh, catchphrase, if you didn't know that. And then we have the SS Georgie. So yeah, we got some cool pins on there, and um, it's time to get on with the Marvel Legends display. So what my plan is, is to have different uh, spots. So I'm going to cut out one for Stark Industries, uh, one for the Captain America area, one for the Ant-Man area, and one for the Thor Ragnarok area, which that's actually pretty big, which I'm going to just cut around the words. But um, I do have some of my new figures up. I actually have all of them up, but I might change it up. So I have Tony Stark, and I have the Iron Man Infinity Gauntlet, which looks amazing, right, by Tony. We've got the Mark 80 Iron Man and the Mark 1 Iron Man side by side because, uh, as far as we know, the last suit he'll ever wear and the first suit he ever wore. So I think that's really cool. Uh, though there are rumors that Tony Stark's returning. God, I hope so. Uh, we have my new War Machine, and I added uh, the Blast Effects that came with this uh, Iron Man figure, because he came with four of them. So I added those, and then we have Rescue coming out behind him. And then we have my Captain America area, my Thor Ragnarok area, and I have uh, Korg on this, like, cube, this clear cube. I have the Ant-Man area, and we're probably going to add more figures, maybe make this all closer together. I feel like it's a bit spread out. But, uh, yeah. First, let's cut out those logos. This is the cutting logo song. I'm making it up as I go. I didn't want to get copyrighted, so I'm making my own song for this. I'm cutting! I'm cutting! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Cutting is so much fun, and it's in fast time! So you don't have to watch all me cutting! Okay, all done. Um, now let's put them up. Okay, so we're going to have to take off this Avengers logo that I've had for a very long time to put up Stark Industries, and that looks pretty good. Let's just, I have the tape folded there, and that looks really nice, I must say. I actually really like it. Now we just have to do Ragnarok, uh, Captain America, and Pym Particles. And there we go, we've got them up, and I must say, it doesn't look that bad. You know, I think it looks good. Now, I'm pretty sure we should add a few figures, so uh, let's look through. Maybe Thor um, for the Thor Ragnarok, you know? I might have to make a custom patch for his eye and um, maybe have him have a sword instead of Stormbreaker because he doesn't have it yet, but I think we can make it work. Well, I was going to give him the axe that uh, Scourge came with, but I was using that for Scourge, so... This came with a 12-inch Black Panther, and it might work. I was also trying to make a eye patch for him, but I didn't have any clay or anything, so uh, that's not going to work. But maybe we can try to see if we could fit that. Well, it does look a little big, but um, it could work, you know? He had all this like this, these weird weapons for Ragnarok, so maybe it'll work. Let's see how he looks up there. Well, you know what? He doesn't look that bad. Now, this Iron Man display is, oh my gosh, it's my favorite. I mean, look at that, just like, boom, that just looks amazing. I love it, I love it so much. Uh, this Ant-Man display looks pretty good. I feel like it looks thin over there. We could add that in another time, but I'm um, glad I got these uh, logos up there. And you know what? It doesn't look that bad. So guys, thanks for watching. I'm glad with how this take came out. We didn't really change the display of the figures. We just added like a few figures and uh, added logos, but it looks good. 
I'm glad about it, and uh, if you have any ideas on what I should do, let me know down below, and I will definitely uh, test it out in another video, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace!